So, Kevin, what was it like to uh, watch the finals? How much of the finals did you actually watch? Uh, it was tough to watch it, you know, not being a part of it. Uh, you know, but it's, I love watching basketball. And it was the only basketball on. Um, but it, it was tough. It was tough not being a part of it. But it was extra uh, motivation to, you know, try to help my team get back next season. So, um, you know, it was, it was a great, great, uh, great final going seven games. And, you know, both teams played hard. That it was LeBron winning again, how did that make you feel? I mean, it's, you know, if the Spurs would have won, I'd have felt the same way. Uh, but those guys, you know, Miami's a really, really good team. Uh, they came together and, um, and did what every team wants to do, which is win a championship. So, you know, you can't knock them for that. People know you worked out with LeBron last year. What did you learn from him? I was just seeing how he worked, how he approached the game. And, um, you know, he's a guy that, that you know, gives it his all. And... Um, you can really respect guys like that, you know, a so, um, guy that you know, has done everything in the league. He continues to, you know, try to look for things to get better. So, you know, it was a real, real, uh, you know, eye-opener to me and uh, helped me out. You mentioned uh, you're working on something this off offseason, uh, kind of Magic Johnson it. Ish. Uh, what, what are you What are you working on? Just everything. Just trying to add different different moves to my to my repertoire and just trying to come back a, a better player. Uh, you know, it's just moves I'm trying to master. Like you said, the Magic Johnson hook shot. I'm just trying to trying to master that, and it's going it's going to take me some time. But I'm looking forward to uh, to getting better at it. And I just can't wait till the season rolls back around and you know get back with my teammates and you know have fun playing the game that I love. Caught a lot of attention with the announcement that you were going to go to Jay Z for marketing, yeah. and then and, and as your agent, uh, leading Rob Palinka. Mm-hmm. Uh, why? It just seemed like a perfect move to me. It's something that um. You know, there's it, it, no risk in doing. You know, Jay Z is a guy that's well respected in the business area. Um, you know, a, a guy that you know has done so well for himself and his brand. And um, I'm looking forward to partnering with him and, and learn as much as I can from him. Yeah, can't be real, yo. What was it like to go to the uh, the scene of the the tornado devastation? It, it was something I'm always going to remember. You know, first off. Um, you know, to see so much damage from a tornado, uh, I, I didn't think, you know, it can happen like that. And It really affected you. It did, because it, it was so close to home. And, you know, those people that, you know, I've met, that houses are gone, they were fans of the Thunder. They were guys that worked um, behind the scenes, you know, you know, security guard, one of the security guards, you know, his house was just totally destroyed. Guy that I see, and I, I shake hands with every day before I go into the locker room for a game. So. Um, it was a very, very unfortunate situation. Uh, but like I've been saying, we're going to come together as a city and we're going to get past it. And I got faith that we will.